folks, this is Jamil Swift for Gunstruck Reviews. We're here in Phoenix, Arizona at the headquarters of Enlo Custom Guns with Marty. How you doing, buddy? Good. And today we're going to talk about the Real Avid Bench Vice. Marty has it here, and he's going to give us a brief explanation on how it works and all the features about it. So before we start, I'd like to ask you guys to please like this video, share this video, and subscribe to the channel so we may continue to bring you content like this. So Marty, take it over. So some of the things that are nice about this are as follows. You have the standard aluminum vice jaws, right? So you can clamp some stuff, right? This is, this is gonna mar your finish though if you're gonna work on that. But you can do some, you can do a little bit better, more precise clamping with this, right? Um, you know, this isn't what I would consider a heavy duty vice, but it's a really handy vice. Uh, I've been using it a lot for, uh, especially in like uh, gunsmithing where I'll, I'll hold something and kind of change directions with it a little, little bit. Um, so it's nice for me to hold things for like cleaning. Uh, that's why I'll, I'll use the, the rubber vice jaws, which are pretty nice that they're included. And then obviously they have some angles on the other side for some, some plastic, but still soft jaws. So like if I'm clamping on a material. And uh, one thing that does really nice about it is, is that uh, when I am doing some of that stuff in here, I can, I can change how this vice works. I mean, I can set it up any which way. And especially when I, I'm doing stuff like uh, polishing. Sometimes there's like some weird angles I'll do, right? Where it's like, okay, I just need this to move and cinch down here for a second. Uh, you know, I, I like say, it, it's been a very handy thing for me trying out. Like say, it's not a heavy duty vice. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't like set something in it and start like pounding on it with a hammer, right? But especially for like file fitting and that type of stuff, it's actually been pretty handy. So. Uh, you know, I have another vice, and I, I, I whip this thing out when I need something kind of specific, and for that application, it's actually really good. Um, so one of the nice things is that you can kind of lock in a level here, right? And then from here, like I say, I'm using this uh, sometimes for cleaning, because I actually use a vice more for cleaning than, a, like, say, a, uh, like a cradle, uh, like one of those gun. Uh, one of those things that just kind of holds the, the gun in place, right? And then I can I can adjust a little bit of this angle here, which is kind of nice. Well, Marty, thanks for your explanation of the vice. I know that you use that vice. It as, as looks like a really cool product. I wish I had room to put one in my, my bench. <laughs> my bench is barely has well, half the room in here. Well, I kind of I kind of had to find space to do it. In fact, I, I I made this table specifically to mount a vice right there, and I ended up uh, not even moving my other one. So it was really handy that uh, this yeah. one came about, you know. And, uh, yeah, and this is a great vice because you, you see you can pull it down and push it. It, and it, it really has been helpful. Like I say, it, especially for especially for jobs where you're just getting into a lot of intricate detail, it, it really is nice to be able to move it back and forth. Right? Yeah, um, looks, looks like a really good setup. Mm -hmm. Looks strong for, like you said, for small jobs that you don't have to be pounding on. Yeah, you know, like, I, you know, I, I mean, this. This thing's tough, but it's it's not going to be it's not going to be something that you know. I, I have a heavy duty vice over there, and that's that's meant for that's meant for that type of stuff. Oh, yeah. This is this is more detail, but like I say, it's still strong enough to even hold this thing. This thing's pretty heavy, so I mean. Yeah, and uh, it held it held it perfectly well. So, mm -hmm. and, I, you know, I, I I've used this quite a bit for cleaning too. I mean, that's yeah. just uh, that's looks one like of the things a, I really like. For. Looks like a nice setup to put a slide or a frame. Mm -hmm. And you can go clean and. Mm -hmm. Or know. just uh, running a board brush through like a rifle barrel. That's what I use most commonly. Yeah, yeah. yeah looks like a good product. Well, thanks, Marty. Mm -hmm. Thanks for your explanation. And like always, guys, please remain healthy, stay safe, and definitely have fun at the range. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews. Please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content. Please visit our patron page at www.patreon.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.